I thought taking a video of my fridge would be easier than taking pictures and labeling everything. So here's my fridge. And I can't really zoom out with this. It's just my camera. Anyways, um, I'll start with the door. And I have my juice and milk, ketchup, and just plain yogurt, which is my husband's. I don't care for that. Mustard sauce, which is really nice if you don't really like strong mustard. And it's just like mustard mixed with mayonnaise is basically what it tastes like to me. I really like that. Um, liquid margarine for cooking. Um, a wok sauce, which is teriyaki honey. Really nice. And just some salad dressings more salad dressings and my barbecue sauces I must have Tony Roma from I get from Canada Miss Diana or Diana sauces I have a pile of them in the back of the fridge too all my butters must have for bakings one egg out of eggs right now because I can't get any more at Lidl um, start in the bottom this one's oh, not empty I got some feta cheese and my vegetable and one apple <laughs> tomatoes just some whatever you can see there um let's see some yogurt see as we i think i explained this before in my blog that our yogurt comes in what looks like um packages of uh like milk cartons but they're actually yogurt, and they would have like this plastic knob on the top. This is quark, which is like a very thick yogurt, also quite tasty. Um, meatballs, which I can make my own, but these ones are very tasty. I'll just throw them in here. And these are called puffertjes, and I think I've explained them in my blog too. They're like little tiny pancakes, and a, they come pre-made. My kids just like them. Just warm them up and uh, you've got an instant meal. And yes, I can make them myself too, but I'm lazy. Cheese slices. Once again, lazy. I can slice them myself, but lazy. Lots of uh, meats for sandwiches. And must have bacon. I'm Canadian. And fancy cheese to look good if I have company. See, second drawer, I've got lots of spreadable cheeses. And my daughter decided to try to make jello. She found some at the Lidl. It was Liness or light product. And according to her, it does not taste like normal jello. And she says, Try, Mom. Try this. It tastes disgusting. Just try it. Yeah, right. I'm not falling for that. So I guess that gets thrown out. Um, little mini yogurts for my youngest wrap sauces and pizza quick you can just throw it on your coat on your uh, sandwiches or something or just make a little pizza it's really nice garlic sauce and a chocolate letter still from Santa Claus from my youngest she eats chocolate not so fast um yeah more spreadable cheeses margarine some alcohol um, pate that I won't touch, um, whipped cream, relish, must have in a Canadian fridge, some sparkling water, more sparkling water, Pepsi, must have in my fridge, and let's see up here, Hellman's mayonnaise, must have in my fridge, um, Miracle Whip, also jams, let me see, put some down here. Prunes, must have in a woman's fridge. More taco sauces, more relishes, more barbecue sauces, saute sauces, fish sauces, um, cranberry sauces, shawarma sauces. And that's pretty much it for there. And I'll just quickly show you my freezer. We have french fries for tonight's supper. I have kids sleeping over. Frozen uh, peppers, which I got in Germany. 
and frozen vegetables and frozen bread. I love these drawers. Just can't put too much in. Frozen salmon, frozen English muffins, much easier to buy than make. Frozen strawberries, frozen leftovers, frozen onion rings for a special occasion, more frozen English muffins, a frozen bagel, and frozen saute, and frozen questionables. <laughs> and that's about it. So that's my fridge. And that's me signing off. Bye.